Hello friends, welcome to today's video. In this video, we are going to discuss how to do or how to draw geometrical figures using the turtle. Okay, so using turtle, how will you be able to draw so many mathematical geometrical figures? Okay, so I think in school you might have used compass, protractor and things like that and you have drawn so many mathematical figures right for your mathematical exhibitions right similarly today what we are going to do is using python how you can create such figures is what i am going to show you okay so the first one that i'm going is the helix pattern okay so i hope you can see over here i have written the helix pattern okay so now the helix pattern is going to be each side would have each color okay so let's take six colors for the helix pattern and make each side each color okay so now let's do import turtle now let's give colors is equals to red pink blue yellow purple and green now we need a pen to draw so let's take the pen using the turtle dot pen okay this turtle is the turtle that we have imported okay now let's give the background color let's give turtle dot bg color and let's give a color so i'll be giving black so whichever is the color that you want you can give it's optional if you don't want to give it's very fine okay you no need to give now let's give for x in range of 360 which means 360 degrees it should be moving okay so now we have to give the pen color so the pen color should be changing right so let's give colors of x modulo 6. Now let's give t dot width of x by 100 plus 1. Now let's give the forward of x because it should be moving forward right and in which degree it should be moving to the left of 59 degrees okay. So now let's see how it works okay so now let's save it and run and we are going to see how it looks like okay so I am going to save it here using the geometrical pattern okay so now you can see here that it started drawing but its thickness will be increasing as the size of the helix increases okay So now you can see that the thickness is always increasing because we give as the x increases. Because it's a for loop, x will increase from 0 to 360. As the x increases, your width will also be increasing. Okay. So that is how the elix pattern would look like. Okay. So now let's move on to the next one. The next one is the circular pattern. Okay. So let me delete this is the circular pattern okay that we are going to do so in this what we are going to do is first step is import the turtle okay so now let's give x is equals to turtle dot screen now let's give like turtle dot speed the speed that we are going to set how many milliseconds you want you can give i'll be giving two milliseconds okay so now for i in range of 30 
okay let's give whatever how many circles you want you can just give that now let's give turtle dot circle of 5 into i because 5 times the i it would be drawing then only it will be visible to us okay so now here you can see that it's drawing the circles upward right similarly if you want the circles downward what you have to do is like do turtle dot circle of minus 5 into i okay then it will be drawing the circle downward Okay, the spelling of the circle is wrong, sorry. Okay, now let's see. Okay, so now you are able to get the circle upward as well as downward, right? Now to do the circular pattern, what do you have to do? The flower pattern using circles, you might be familiar, right? We can do, okay? What you have to do is, this will continue, okay? So that's why I am moving. Let's give like turtle dot left of i. Okay, so each time the i changes, your circle drawing angle will also be changing. Okay. It's taking so long. So let's change it to 10 so that it will be drawing much faster. Because it's too millisecond, it's too long, slow, right? I'll change it to 50. Then it will be much faster. So now can you see this? This is the circular pattern, okay? Now let's move on to the next task. It is to draw the squares, okay? Square in and out okay so first of all we have to start from a small square and then create much larger squares okay so let's do that import turtle let's create a variable called w is equals to turtle dot screen this is for the screen now let's create a background color let's give like background color of light green any color you want you can choose okay now let's give turtle dot turtle okay so now let's give a color for turtle as well as let's give turtle dot color and it's blue okay so now what we are going to do is let's create a function for doing these squares okay square function of size so whatever is the size that you are going to pass to this function would be taken okay so as it is a square we are taking 4 and let's give forward forward even you can use the short form fd okay there is no problem now let's give the left of 90 right as it is a square now let's give size plus is equals to 5 so each time your size changes your size changes then it will be incrementing by 5 and there the pen will be waiting okay so now let's give the function call okay so I'll be taking the function call just copied and pasted it now we can do it like this right So now as it is a square and it should be starting from smaller to the larger box means you have to set the values in such a way that the first one should be a smaller number then it should be changing to higher number okay. One not six, one twenty six. 146 and 166 okay now let's see i in i forgot in right
so now can you see it's just drawing a small box to a bigger box so i hope you were not able to see it properly so let me show it to you again so from a smaller box of size 6 to a bigger box of size 166 it is drawing okay so now what if you want a box from a bigger box to a smaller box okay you just need to make it much the square the function called to be reversing okay so let's give here like 166 146 126 106 86 66 46 and 26 right i forgot to give yeah 166 106 okay i didn't forget let's give it to be 186 okay so now you can see that it is not going in the same way right because there is some error so what was the error is that it's not plus 5 if you are starting from a bigger number to a smaller number then it is a minus in the function okay so now you will be able to get from a bigger box to a smaller box okay so that's all for today's video i hope you like this video in the next video we will be discussing how to create a turtle raising game using this turtle okay so i hope this video was interesting for you if this video was interesting for you please do like share and subscribe to my channel okay don't forget guys and see you in the next video bye bye